let's talk but about somehow, weather. None Go of ahead. us. None of us have them. Right. Yeah. I was no. talking about weather, but you're right. That is a good point. None of us have them. <laughs> Jessica, no, do you have Jessica. them? Yeah. I don't. Okay, wow. I don't. Okay. No. That's, we're very unpopular. We're, okay? we're, we're not the cool kids. We're not that clearly. That's okay. That's okay. We're, we're, you know what? We've got an extra, what? How much do they cost? $50? We each have an extra $50 yeah. in our bank account. True. <laughs> Perfect. There you go. Because of that. And we're going to get close to 50 degrees later on this week. How's that for a tease? We have some temperatures that are going to be improving as we go through the next few days. So that's going to feel very nice for us. We are looking at all rain as far as our precipitation is concerned for now. We are still going to be fairly active uh, over the next uh, several days with mostly rain. Could get a little bit of wet snow to mix in there for Sunday, but generally speaking rain and that's going to be the case for the next few days here so we can run out that rainfall forecast all the way through Friday morning most of us looking at about another inch of a rain on top of what we've already had for the soggy uh, day we've had today we do have some wet conditions out on the roadways that's to be expected. We've had some steady rain all day after that freezing rain this morning. So wet conditions out there. Our temperatures are above freezing. We're sitting at 36 degrees right now. One thing to notice, our dew points have come up quite a bit from where they were yesterday. They were in the teens yesterday. So those dew points have come up. We've got a more humid environment out there, and we do have rain still falling uh, for some locations. So we're going to keep that chance of rain in the forecast as we go through the evening here. We've got that steadier rain moving off to the east right now. It's primarily along and east of I-77 where we have that steadier rain. So we're going to see that becoming a little less steady as we get into that evening commute and into the overnight hours. A bit of a lull in, again, that steady action. We'll still see the chance for a couple spotty showers, but the steady rain is exiting. We are going to see more returning though. All of this connects down to the Gulf of Mexico. We've got another push of moisture coming up from the Gulf. That's going to cause some additional steady rain as we get into tomorrow and we're probably going to get another round into later Thursday as well. So that rain is going to keep on coming for us. For the south, that's going to mean some flooding potential. So that's an issue the folks down there are going to deal with with all that moisture. We've got some fog issues just off to our west. I don't think we'll see any dense fog advisories necessarily, but some patchy fog certainly going to be possible for us tonight. And with tapping into all this Gulf of Mexico moisture, we're also going to tap in to some Gulf of Mexico warmth as well. That's been trying to rebuild after the deep chill we had. Those 50s getting as far north as Nashville, some areas of Kentucky, Charlotte, and they're going to continue to try to push north as we go through the next couple of days. So that warming trend is going to be with us. National Design Mart Hour by Hour forecast does show still some spotty showers as we go through the evening and overnight. Our temperatures are going to hold pretty steady, maybe warm a couple degrees as we have into tomorrow morning. If you have an early drive tomorrow, better chance to miss some of that steady rain, but that steady rain is going to be arriving as we go through commute time, and then we'll see that steady rain really sticking around as we go through much of your Wednesday. We could have some pockets of heavier rain mixed in there as at times. Temperatures will be improving. We're going to be well into the 40s, maybe even close to 50 down south through tomorrow afternoon. That steady rain does taper off a little bit as we get into the overnight. We'll still keep that chance for some showers around as we get into Thursday, especially Especially later in the day, we'll have yet another round of those steady showers returning. So the Union Home Mortgage seven day outlook, we're going to keep that chance for rain around through at least Thursday. Friday, we're going to watch for temperatures in the 40s. We're drying out a little bit into the weekend. We're going to watch a system moving through that could give us some rain changing over to snow and then temperatures uh, briefly back close to around average into the first part of next week, guys. We hope you got to enjoy the snow over the weekend and Monday. It's going to do a lot of melting um, for the rest yeah. of the week. That snow is going to be long gone for most of us by the time we get to the weekend. Okay. Right. Thanks, Jessica.